Hey guys, what's up? So today we're gonna do something just a little bit different. We're gonna go take it back, do a little flashback Friday or throwback Thursday, whatever you wanna call it, and revisit an oldie but goodie. We're going to do a what's in my handbag segment, which today should probably be what's in my backpack segment because I'm carrying this big old backpack with me today. It's just really cute. It's from Giuseppe Zanotti and um, I got it last year and it's one of my favorite pieces. Um, today I'm hanging out at Royalty Juice Bar, so shout out to them for accommodating me so that we can shoot this here. One of my favorite places in all of California. I love them. I love the people here. I love the juice. I love, this is a smoothie, the food, everything's really good. In fact, all my friends love it here too. You turned me on to it and now I'm hooked. <laughs> it's like crack. It is like crack. Mm -hmm. I was just telling them that it's like, I haven't found another juice bar. No, I don't go to any place else. No, I won't go. We only come to royalty. That's right. Yeah, <gasps> such a surprise. I know, I love, I love your hair. Love you never know what's gonna happen here at the juice bar. Clearly, I was totally caught off guard when my girlfriend, Garcelle Beauvais, showed up. This is also her favorite juice bar. I think it's everybody's juice bar, uh, favorite juice bar. So, like, not just a shameless plug. You seriously need to check out Royalty Juice Bar here in Studio City. Anyway, now let's get back to my big fat backpack. So just to show the bag a little bit, it's all fuzzy, all fur, all over, but the straps are leather and durable so they won't get messed up. And then I think my favorite part of this backpack is actually the flap because it has the big Giuseppe Zanotti insignia on it with all this other gold hardware, which I just love because they match my sneakers. And then the tie on it, which is kind of annoying, it's made out of leather, but it's very stiff. So it's good and bad. Oh my God. So I've got stuff in here that I recently put in here and the stuff that's just been in here since last year. Comb. Every black girl you know probably has a rat tail comb in her purse or car or backpack somewhere. My little pouch. This is one of the pouches I use when I carry this backpack to keep my stuff separated. This is actually an Ever Leger um, pouch that was a gift to me. And in here I have some Peter Thomas Roth lotion, which I love Peter Thomas Roth um, products, but that actually came from a hotel. Speaking of hotels, more hotel lotion. Oh yeah, my Pure Cosmetics um, lip gloss. This is the exposed color. Really, really cute, it's what I have on now. Um, my little Bath and Body Works antibacterial lotion or sanitizer. I have a gold Sharpie. <laughs> Maybe because I might just like blow up overnight and need to sign some autographs. I don't know why I have a gold Sharpie in my bag. Christian Louboutin. Just Nothing Lipstick, which is almost down to nothing because I use it a lot. Oh yeah, Flonase. Anybody have allergies? I do. I don't know why I have that in my purse, actually, because I only need to take it one time a day. That's really weird. Okay, so I have, this is a portable charger. It's really cool. I plug in the car or in the wall to charge. But I'm being real ratchet right now because Kool-Aid and no sugar. Because I don't have the actual cord that goes into my phone to actually charge it, the USB cord. Uh, yeah, I don't know where it is. Headphones, these are my Bose headphones. These are really cute. I think I bought them because of the color. They're like blue and like lime green. Same color as this pouch. They're really, really good headphones. I actually use these when I'm on the plane and I have to edit because they're compact and you can hear everything in them. All the girl products, tampons. I, I don't think anybody, any female that's still cycling runs around without these at some point. A liner and two tampons. I actually like this brand. This is um, the U, it's by Kotex, but it's that U brand, whatever, U shape, I forgot. A little elk. This is actually my youngest son's elk. My purse hook. Ever need a purse hook? Never leave home without it. You shouldn't either. Um, we sell these on housepot.com, by the way, if you ever want one. They're like less than 10 bucks, I think. They might be right at 10 bucks. My tea. 
I love tea that I, so much I carry my own mint tea around because most places don't have the mint tea that I like. I have a brush. My wallet. This is actually a Chanel wallet. I've had this for a really, really long time. Holds a lot of stuff. No cash, just receipts. <laughs> and of course it doesn't close because it's too much stuff in here. Oh yeah, some pins. Um, my checkbook, you don't need to be looking at all that. It's big, huh? It's my company checkbook. This little guy, the irony in this, this was given to me by one of the owners of this place, the, the daughter. She's actually the, the head chef and nutritionist here. And she gave me this for Christmas. Very, very cute. It's a Kate Spade little credit card holder and it really comes in handy. I took this to Fashion Week with me and it really saved my life because I could slip a couple credit cards and my license and a little cash in here and either stick it in my pocket or stick it in a small clutch without you know your stuff flying around everywhere. Very, very convenient. One of my favorite gifts actually for Christmas. Oh yeah, and a hair tie. I was looking for this, my phone. Here's my phone. Um, I have the tie light case on it, if you've never seen that. It lights up, it's kind of like a diva ring light. Are you taking selfies? Yes. I have a couple pair of glasses. These are actually new to houseofpot.com. These are so cute. These are actually my favorite pair of everything that we have in the store. Oh yeah, my keys, my gym ID card, my iPod shuffle. Shuffles have gotten real fancy now, y'all. Real fancy. Also hot discount cards. Y'all's discount is much more than that one. Hand sanitizer wipes. And my mailbox key. Let's see what's in the front pocket. Okay, well clearly I haven't used this pocket because the stuffing is still in there. And this one, oh, well dang. This gum, I swear I've been looking for this gum for eight months. Brand new, never opened, it's probably stale as can be now. And don't judge, I don't know why this is in my bag at all. So yeah, that's it. So that's everything that's in my handbag. Now we've all sat here and been nosy together. Honestly, I didn't really know what all was in this bag. Some of the stuff like this and the gum. Hey, Southwest. Anyway, um, if you want the purse up or the sunglasses, I'll put the links down below so you can find those easily. Those are on houseofpot.com. As far as some of the other stuff, oh, like the Pure Cosmetics lip gloss. I think they still sell this. Um, it's a really, really pretty nude color. It has just a little sparkle in it, so it's not too much. I'll try to find that link and put it down below. If not, then I'll just put the web address to their site so you can see the other stuff. That's it. I hope you have fun being nosy with me. I'll see you guys next time. And um, yeah, shout out to Garcelle. Hey girl, thanks for stopping by. <laughs> Bye. I'm a dork.